Hey guys, welcome back uh, to another uh, thoughts video. I don't, I don't do reviews uh, reviews yet because I'm 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 not an expert yet on my fragrances. I just got started uh, this last year. I'm still uh, still studying fragrances, uh, trying my best to understand how it works. I'm I'm just giving you guys my impression about fragrances so uh, it will be uh, really long before I start doing reviews so this video is about Ambra Calabria by Nishani so uh, if you guys have seen my first impression video uh, or if you've not seen my video uh, it's all right so this opens up with um, very white flowery slash uh, green typical citrus uh, or floral kind of a freshness fresh scent right and 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 uh, it's nice and within within about 10 minutes right <laughs> it starts to smell like a completely different fragrance uh, what I get is initially for some uh, this 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 green uh, thing citrus thing completely disappears and then I start to get a little bit of uh, musk uh, a sweet musk uh, maybe slightly ozonic I don't know where I'm getting the ozonic uh, the aspect from and after some time it becomes like a creamy uh, musk so it, 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 except for the first 10 minutes it's it's uh, mostly a musky fragrance in the first impression video I, I couldn't uh, um, you know uh, pick point or couldn't recall what exactly is that I was smelling there was this uh, this sweetness and then this ozonic uh, thing that I was smelling and then I thought okay where is this coming from but then I realized like it must be musk because you, in in musk right you get this this uh, slight body odorish kind of a uh, kind of a, a smell like like uh, uh, what I mean is like you, it's like as if the smell that you get when you when you wear a deodorant right like uh, the deodorant mixes with sweat and then it gives or something that, that kind of smell is is what I'm getting uh, in the dry down mostly and I think it, it it's coming from musk. And it's a very creamy musk so this is a very nice fragrance like if you see um, in, in the fragrant trigger page you have bergamot green leaves and galbanum I'm getting that like uh, even jasmine maybe but jasmine is not that prominent uh, it, it's it, it it has been blended well with the other green notes and bergamot or whatnot so what I'm getting at the top is a mix of these some of these top and middle notes and within 10 minutes within 10 15 minutes uh, it it it, uh, it becomes a creamy musk that's it and then that's 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 what I'm, I'm getting right now I'm, I'm wearing it and I get this beautiful scent cloud or I may I keep, keep getting lots of it it's a very creamy musk that I, that, that's what I keep smelling it's nice it's very nice but it, it it the transition is a bit abrupt is what I felt like it 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 feels like some it it, it uh, smells wrong I remember watching uh, Demi Rollins uh, video sometime back and then his uh, her boyfriend points out that for one of the fragrances he points out that this smells wrong <laughs> I couldn't understand what he was saying at that time I realize it now this smells wrong this smells uh, not wrong as in it smells like you know the, the transition is not smooth as if uh, as if two opposite uh, uh, no accords have been uh, they, they, have, they have tried to blend it but it, it kind of you know it, it's like water and oil that's what I uh, it, that's the feeling that I get it first 10 minutes smells like something and then the next uh, the dry out it smells like completely different fragrance like 
but but that's like uh, that's something that, that I noticed. I'm not saying it smells it smells bad or anything. It's a nice fragrance, and I think it's it's a it's a very unique fragrance. Like I, I have not tried any fragrance that that smells like this. Although I have tried fragrances with with musk in it, but this is a very pleasant smelling fragrance, uh, and uh, and you can wear it. I be, I believe pretty much throughout the year, and it. You you you'd smell you'd smell different. It's not it's not your uh, it's not your typical citrus fragrance or anything like that. And and the, I don't think there's any fragrance that smells like this currently in the in the market. It, it smells very unique as well. Uh, and again that again take it with a grain of salt because I'm new to the fragrance uh, uh, thing here in the first place. And I have very limited knowledge about fragrances if you watch my previous videos there's only about 40 50 fragrances that i've tried so far and so if you are a fragrance connoisseur or something like that uh, uh pardon me uh, but but i i think it's a very nice fragrance i'm still like a cat on the wall whether to buy this or not because it is it is fine it's all right it has this addictive uh, scent about it especially in the dry round it, it's a very addictive thing it, I, 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 whenever I, I uh, you know, move around and then give, get, uh, get uh, whiffs of it, it's nice. Um, yeah, so let's see what, uh, what have I tried? Like, it, it, this is the Nishari website that I see, it's Turkish website, right? Tia. Abracadabra, get ready to witness the magical transition of her opening of her of a romantic mixture of Calabrian bergamot and green notes into sweet amber and vanilla. So this unusually fresh leafy green amber fragrance is intriguing and inviting one both for special of you. So I think that is what they probably went for. This 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 uh, I don't know this. But but just the the transition to me it uh, it 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 smells very abrupt. The transition is not smooth, is what I'm trying to say. But apart from that, it's a, it's a nice fragrance. Anyway, thanks a lot, guys, for watching. Bye bye.